Hello, and we're back here at the 14th Annual San Francisco Black Film Festival. I'm here with Leela Nicole. Leela Nicole, who has a film in this year's festival called Oak Town. She's a Bay Area native, right? Bay Area native. Um, currently, she's not residing in the Bay, uh, but wanted to bring her film up here so that it can be showcased at this film festival. Uh, Leela, can you tell us a little bit about your film, Oak Town? Um, Oak Town is about three young ladies who live in Oakland, California, and the film goes through the dynamics of their life. They're three friends, even though they have different journeys, what they're doing is they're still, um, they still support each other while they're on their journeys in life. So it's just the trials and tribulations of growing up in Oakland, California. All right, sounds like a very interesting film. You know, people who maybe aren't from here in Oakland can get a, a perspective of what it's like for the people that do live here in the city. Um, Let's see, how did you find out about this year's San Francisco Black Film Festival? Have you been a part of it before? Is it your first time? You know, share with us how you got involved. Well, this is my first time at the San Francisco Black Film Festival. I learned about it through KPFA. They um, um, advertised it on the radio, and um, I know a couple of people who work at the radio station. They suggested that I um, submit my film, and here I am today. All right, all right. We've over the course of the last couple of days, I've I've seen like the various ways that people have learned about the film festival, and I, I believe that Kali O'Ray, the director, is doing a great job of, of promoting it to the the people out there. Uh, let's see, are there any other projects that you're currently working on, in, in addition to Oaktown, that may be coming out in the future? Well, currently, what we're trying to do is get distribution for Oaktown because um, we're showing it as a short, but I would like to have it as a series. So I have written like six episodes already. So what we're doing right now is we're just looking for distribution. So we're just pushing it. And I thought it would be better for everyone in the Bay Area to find out about Oaktown versus, you know, before I submit and have distribution so I can get a more following. That was my goal. There may be some people who didn't get a chance to come out to this year's San Francisco Black Film Festival. Um, we're trying to, you know, encourage everyone to get out and check it out. If you didn't make it this year's, make it to next year's. Um, but though, for those who maybe didn't make it out to this year's festival, how would they find uh, Oak Town? If they wanted to check it out and they didn't make it out here. Um, you can visit our website, which is homegirlvision.com. Um, we have the website up. We have a trailer of Oak Town. Also, we have um, a cast, pictures of the cast, and the behind the scenes. And also, we have a little press junkets that um, all the characters and all the actors play for Oak Town. All right, you guys heard it. Leela Nicole, the movie is Oak Town. All right, if you haven't had a chance to check it out, visit the website. Um, sounds like it's a great movie about life in the city of Oakland, California. Uh, we'll be back in just a moment with more filmmakers from the 14th Annual San Francisco Black Film Festival. We're gathered here this evening because too many of our young men are being killed by those that are supposed to protect and serve us. Yeah, reporting live from the ghetto. In his sippers, rim and sippers, everybody, hello. Welcome to the turf, foreigners. They admire us, hearing us, make them want to be till they really see. Hassan is organizing a protest against the cop who shot Markel. You with that? You know I'm always down for a good cause. What time? Where's it at? Don't take all damn day. Last time I had to wait two hours after my name was called. Okay, I'm gonna be there on time. Dang. Bye. What do you mean, Bob? Why are you getting off the phone? And last night when we talked, you said you would be there to pick me up. <laughs> I know, darling. I know. I know. I. It's just that you know what? I'm still trying to put things together for the collection. I'm. I'm really sorry. That's why I'm so happy my baby daddy locked up. Cause I don't know what I'd do if he got shot or something. <laughs> Come on, mama. Let me shampoo. We're back here at the 14th Annual San Francisco Black Film Festival. I have a couple of the cast members from the movie Oak Town with me. If you can introduce yourselves, please. Uh, I'm Bernard Payne. I play Drew. I'm Sharonica Cleveland, and I play Shima. All right. Can uh, one of you guys share with me with us a little bit about the movie Oak Town? All right. Um, Oak Town is actually based off three girls who grew up in the Oakland area. They were best friends growing up, but as they got older, they went on three separate paths. And it's just about the trials and tribulations that they go through trying to maintain their friendship, but as they're growing apart as well. All right, does that sum it up? Anything you want to add to that? Uh, yeah, well, I, I play a guy, well, I'll say what it's about. Um, 
it's about the inner city life, man, about what's going on in Oaktown, like uh, the p police corruption, uh, the day and day of Oaktown, man. It's, uh, it's real gritty, you know? All right. Sharonica, um, can you tell us a little bit about your particular role in this film and how you got involved with the movie Oaktown? Um, I play Shima, which is his wife, and I'm basically the arch nemesis of one of the three main characters, his baby mom. I married him and had a baby by him, but she's still in love with him and has two girls by him. And he's in jail, so we really don't know who he's really going to be with when he gets out or whatever. But um, I got involved with the project through LA Casting or Actors Access, one of them. I read the, the, the breakdowns for it and I was like, oh, these are interesting characters. I was reading about all of them and the one that I ended up playing was one that was totally out of the box for me. So it was so much fun to, to try this and to be this person that you don't really want to be in real life, but it's really fun to play on screen. All right. Sounds like it sounds like uh, I'm sure it's always wonderful to be able to to try and stretch your creative, you know, this as an actor and act or actress and try new things. Yes. Let's see. Uh, Bernard, uh, can you tell us a little bit about your particular role in the film and how you got involved with the movie Oaktown? OK, um, my character's name is Drew. He's incarcerated. He has a baby mama and a wife. She plays my wife. And <laughs> um, I, I kind of view myself as like kind of crazy, kind of nutty because I don't. Uh, it's like, it's like I'm oblivious to what I'm doing. It's like I can actually care less how they feel. It's like uh, I'm a manipulator. I, the only thing I care about is Drew. Not, Bernard's not like that, but Drew is. And uh, <laughs> um, it's, like very, it's a very interesting character. Actually, how I dove into the character was like I uh, looked at interviews from like Richard Ramirez and like Charles Manson, and I realized like people like these, like people like Drew and these characters, they don't believe uh, what society views as wrong or right. It's just like, I do what I want because I can. And I got involved in the project through uh, LA Casting and uh, when I read the script, it was just like a done deal. Well, last thing before we wrap up, um, as actors, uh, one of the things that I've learned is, and, and also filmmakers, is connections are very important. Um, so for you guys, you know, is there any type of contact information you'd like to share to potential filmmakers that are looking for talent such as yourselves for up and coming projects? You can find me on Facebook.com slash Sharonica Cleveland, and I'll spell that S-H-A-R-O-N-I-C-A-C-L-E-V-E-L-A-N-D. All right, Bernard, how about you? Uh, I'm really not big on social networking, even though I know I should be. I just like face-to-face -face interactions, but you can find me at V-A-N-A-R-D dot P-A-Y-N-E three as in number three at gmail.com. And from there, we, we can go from there. I'm also a mu musician, a model, actor. I do it all, all facets of life. Well, you didn't tell them you did the music for Oaktown. Oh, now I don't have to tell them. You told them. <laughs> well, I did the theme song to Oaktown. Please check it out. All right, the movie is Oaktown, you guys. You got the contact information. A couple of uh, great young actors we have here. Uh, appreciate you guys taking a moment to talk with us today. Uh, stay tuned. We'll be back with more filmmakers from the 14th Annual San Francisco Black Film Festival.